Happening today on the stage, the Ox Dog Theater invites you to experience a ghost story like no other. A young woman is put in charge of two seemingly innocent children in a remote English country house, but as the story unfolds, things are anything but idyllic in Henry James's classic, The Turn of the Screw. Joining us now are the stars of the show, Abby Van Gerpen and Brennan Foster. Thank you guys for joining us. Thanks for being with us. So you, you had me a ghost story, first of all. <laughs> uh, were either of you familiar with the novella that the story is based on before you started work on this? Um, I was a little bit just because I was an English major in college, um, so we had studied it quite a bit um, through there, but that was, you know, decades ago, so, <laughs> 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 so it had been a while. Okay. okay, and how about you, Brennan? I wasn't as familiar with mm -hmm. the story. I got to read the script a little bit earlier, and I think the story Henry James wrote the original ghost story, The Turn of the Screw, and he's known for really big, florid language, mm -hmm. and this script is kind of really pared down, really clear, really spooky, and really fun. And you both are two of the main characters, and Brennan, you actually play multiple characters, is that yeah. correct? Yes. I play the housekeeper, Mrs. Gross, and I play the 10-year-old boy that uh, is, is being looked after mm -hmm. named Miles, and, uh, and also the uncle who hires her to look after his niece and nephew wow. in the house. Ooh. Wow, and then of course you were playing, the, as we were talking, the governess, the woman who is yes. charged with, with looking after these mm -hmm. kids. Now, this is also described as a psychological thriller, so there's kind of a question of, are, are they haunted, are these ghosts real? There's, there's a lot of play of what's real and what's, what's fantasy or what's imagined. Is that right with your character? Um, yeah, it's kind of um, up to the audience to decide what the ultimate thing happening is. Really? Um, so it kind of leaves the audience questioning and going home with it, thinking it over. And, and that's the great thing about art is that it should make you think. It should yeah. make mm -hmm. you think for a couple days. So. And it doesn't leave you with an easy answer. Right, is that right? yeah. Okay. It's still started. argued today by PhD you know, no <laughs> doctors. Yeah, so. <laughs> wow. Interesting. Yeah, no one knows. And now when it comes to you guys playing these characters, were there any challenges when it comes to, you know, a thriller like this or a horror story? You know, actually, it's just so much fun. <laughs> I can imagine. Yeah. <laughs> you never think about how um, how it, it's affecting the audience, mm -hmm. but there are gasps and there are laughs and everything like that. Um, it's, it's just been a blast to see the response. Yeah. And a lot of people are wanting, that saw it the first week and are planning to come back again. So nice. I recommend <laughs> making your reservations okay. early so that yes. you can come back again mm -hmm. and say like, what did I miss the first right. time? Yeah. And go back and unpack it a little more. Oh, so yeah. we opened last weekend. How many more weekends do we have to run and where can we get tickets to see it? Uh, we run for three more weekends. We run through the 12th of mm -hmm. November. Um, you can get tickets through calling Ox Dog Theater mm -hmm. or... Or go to oxdogtheater.org and ox is spelled A-U-X. Okay. Good to know. Is this, last question, a family one, or should we maybe think mom and dad, date night? Well, <laughs> that's <laughs> a good that's question. Yeah. That's, not that's little good, kids. Not little okay. kids. Yeah. Not, not little kids. There are a little bit of, like, jump, scary. like, okay. little scary moments in the show, but it is, um, I think it's fun for people, like, PG-13. Yeah, PG-13. Yeah, yeah, PG yeah. PG-13. I want to go see this. This sounds like a really exciting show, guys. Yeah. Thanks for being Thank with us. So uh, congrats on the opening weekend success, the mm -hmm. opening weekend break legs with the rest of the run. And if you want more information on this show playing now through uh, November November 12th, is that what we said? Through November 12th. Mm -hmm. At the Ox Dog Theater, head over to foxnewmexico.com.